What? Javi and Joe are vlogging today. Hi, Javi. What's up, guys? Long time no see. We're going to show you what we've been up to. Patio Bar and Food Truck Park is opening up in Northeast El Paso. That's right. This is Neve Collective. It's going to be a food truck patio bar, and it will be open in the next six to eight months, and it's located off of Dyer near Hercules. If you missed it, Northeast El Paso has a new food truck park with the grand opening happening, happening over the weekend. The food trucks are providing the food. We are providing the drinks. So there is a space where you can come sit outside, grab your food from the food trucks, grab a drink at the bar, and just hang out. vlogging today. We are here at Neep Collective. I'm gonna show you around. Show you what we've been up to for the last forever. Javi's behind me. Javi! Ryan, would you prefer not to be on camera? I, I'd love to be on camera with you guys. <laughs> Check one, two, three, four. Check one, two. I think that's all right, dude. Yeah. I gotta see Javi's face of approval. <laughs> sound check. check, check, one, two, three, four, check. So NEEP stands for Northeast El Paso, and that's the area of El Paso where I grew up. We ended up building out an entire bar and patio and food truck space. We're going to show you exactly what NEEP is, and first and most importantly, is to get a drink at the bar. I was going to say let's order food, but... No, drink first. Get a drink, walk around and order. That's the perfect way to do it. So this is actually really fun because we get to be guests at our own establishment, which we don't do very often. We Never. haven't actually like <laughs> completely like hung out with friends or anything in a long time here, like ever here. So that's what we're doing today. We have Diego running the bar back there. Oh my God, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, he's actually, you must remember him from one of at least two of our videos. He's 100%. Cool. He's blonde now. <laughs> and Stop! What's wrong with you? Anyway, Diego runs our bar when we are not present. He's our bar manager. Also, my brother-in-law, Javi's little brother. But he's running the bar today. We're going to order a drink. Yep. Grab some food. Sounds like a plan. Deal. <laughs> We are gonna go sit with our friends and put this camera right in their face. Can we join you? Hey friends, this is Tom. This is Nicole. So we're getting all the food today. Like too much food. We're gonna have to give it away. We're here with my favorite poppin'. We try to get them to commit full time, but they haven't yet, so. <laughs> so we're here with Rosie's Dava, with our wonderful friends, Omar and Eileen, and the family. Yes. Yeah. 
They do Indian food, which we are obsessed with. Can I do a non dia with and then a butter chicken and a samosa? Bye, bye, family. <laughs> I love them. So, so good. We're so sorry to our friends for, you know, <laughs> making them eat their food on camera when they're not used to it like us. But honest reactions. They love rosies. You guys love it, right? It's so All good. So we don't always have rosies, but then when they pop in, we take full advantage. And they're usually here every single time that rosies pops in. Yeah. And you know they're here because you smell it immediately and it makes you gravitate to it. We never had a non-deer or don't know what a non-deer is. It's non-bread stuffed with cheese. So you get the best of the Mexican uh, influence in non-dia. Quesadilla, but a non-dia. And then we did a split, and we did half butter chicken, half curry. Mm. The best. So this is Munchies. They're kind of our OGs. They've been with us since the very beginning, since we, since we first opened. I would say like American bar food fair, um, loaded fries, loaded nachos, amazing burgers, they have some tacos. So we're going to try their brisket burger today because we haven't had a chance to try it. We're going to grab something from one of our good friends, Adriana and Cesar over at Las Comadres. Come on. <laughs> we love them both around here, and we also love their food. So, we're gonna try the wings today. Your wings? Yes. You a kind. The nip sauce. The nip sauce? Yes, man. The nip sauce. She was messing around with flavors the other day and let us try them, and then she's like, what do we name it? And I said the nip sauce. Another buzzer. I think almost all of these places usually just notify you when your food's ready with the buzzer so you can hang out, relax on the patio, not have to worry about paying attention when your food's ready, but you still get that like super fun food truck park like vibe, but elevated. burger. I don't know what it is. Thank you. Enjoy. Oh, this is gonna, this is gonna be crazy. Neighbor, you guys enjoying the music tonight? Yeah. Yeah. All right, we got one more song for you guys before uh, we take our next break for the evening. Thank you so much again for taking the time to hang out with us, grabbing a drink, and listening to us. Show them a couple guitars, man. We're around, around, around this old town. In my big old car. of Neep Collective. We want to give you a little taste of what it's like during the day. We gave you a night vibe yesterday, but 
Today's game day at me. Game day, Sunday fun day. We're watching the game and we're gonna eat some food. Great start. Come on now. Not a great way to start, Cowboys. Not a great way to start. Alright guys, we're gonna start out with Desert Oak Barbecue. So they're actually a household name here in El Paso. They have a brick and mortar and we were Fortunate enough to land their food truck here at Neat. All Things Barbecue, they got uh, sandwiches, they have meat by the pound, and that's exactly what I'm gonna get right now. Half a pound of turkey, a quarter pound brisket, and then two wings. And then the El Paso potato. Oh, dude, the El Paso potato is super, super good. I, it's so filling, it's like I know. the fattest potato you can ever that's get. My we're better than Arby's. We got better meat. <laughs> I like that. They they truly have the meats. Some of the best sausage in El Paso. It's got that little kick of spice. Love it. And then their turkey is, oh my god, it is delicious. And then we also got an El Paso potato. This is a desert oak staple. It is a huge potato and then just loaded with beans, cheese, sour cream, salsa, and of course the meat brisket. food we're gonna go grab some more food so we're gonna do a birria melt from a taco truck <laughs> so Los Traviesos they actually do all things tacos but a lot of birria stuff as well so I'm gonna grab the latest thing or the latest addition to the menu a birria melt hi sir how are you this is Luis he's also one of the OGs from day one Can I do your video melt? Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, that's their melt. Okay, so super fast. Comes with the toreado, fries, and this is the melt. Look at that cheese pool. Like crisp, crisp buttery bread. Cheesy goodness, shit ton of freaking baby ass. Sorry, I said that. And then there's a sauce. There is a cheese sauce. So Socialize is here every day, all the time, at Neat Collective. They do funnel cakes, the best funnel cakes, natural ice cream, fried Oreos, what else, what else? Uh, mangoneadas, but that falls under ice cream because that's what Javi's having, I think. Um, so we're going to go ahead and order some desserts because why not? We need to round out our experience with some sweets and they are the best option and our favorite option. Alan and Roxy, great people to work with, but also have created an exceptional menu, and we're very proud to partner with them. And most importantly, I'm excited for some ice cream. Hi, Roxy, one of our favorite people. October 5th and 6th, the Pocketon Community Park. 
much more. We have our natural ice here. So this is mango and lime. That's totally my go-to. You see, if you're on the inn with uh, social ice, you get secret menu items because this is not on the menu typically. But if you want to make any of their natural ice flavors, a cream sickle, it's the ice cream. With mixed with vanilla, their vanilla ice cream and cream. And then we have a funnel cake over here. Basically, like your state fair style dessert. It is funnel cake down here, which is like batter fried, batter deep fried. It's delicious. Powdered sugar, Oreos. Chocolate drizzle, ice cream. So good. And then Oreos. And that's a wrap. And that's a wrap on Javi and Joe and their child's collection.